In this video, we present our preliminary analysis of lightning strikes and fire ignitions on the LNU Lightning Complex Fire using our platform Real-Time Earth. For this analysis, we used four cameras from the alertwildfire.org camera network, including Lake Berryessa, Lake Berryessa East, Atlas Peak West, and Sonoma Mountain. The lightning storm primarily responsible for these ignitions came out of the south. With this grid view of the cameras, we can watch as the lightning storm rolls through the area. This set of cameras captured over 40 lightning strikes associated with this storm. Viewing the storm from Sonoma Mountain, lightning strikes associated with fire ignitions are shown. Using the calibrated alert wildfire cameras in real-time Earth, we can determine the heading of the lightning strikes identified. Going back to the grid view, we can see that a fire ignition has been identified in the Atlas Peak West camera. Visualizing this fire ignition on the landscape, we recognize correspondence with a lightning strike captured in the Sonoma Mountain camera. With this information, we can estimate the start location of the fire. As the storm moves through the area, we identify additional lightning strikes associated with fire ignitions. This lightning strike captured on Berryessa East can have its location more definitively determined given the fact that we can see where the lightning strike hit the ground. Back in the grid view, we can monitor the progression of the lightning storm as it moves through the area. We note fire activity increasing at the ignition point identified in Atlas Peak West. Another fire ignition is spotted beyond a ridge in the Berryessa East camera. With this camera being calibrated, we can estimate the location of this ignition. Back in the grid view, we see increased activity in the Berryessa camera. Four ignitions are identified, three of which are associated with lightning strikes seen in other cameras. Here we visualize the fire ignitions with respect to the lightning storm progression. We continue to monitor the activity of the four ignitions in the Berryessa camera. Going back to Atlas Peak West, we mark up the fire perimeter to estimate its size. The calibrated camera allows us to generate GIS and estimate the size of the fire to be roughly 3 acres. In total, we identified 6 fire ignitions associated with the lightning storm in the 4 alert wildfire cameras that we focused on. Here we display our estimated ignition locations with respect to some of the original fire perimeters published by NIFSI. We note five of the six ignitions identified lie within these perimeters. The four fires associated with these ignitions, including the Gamble, Spanish, Green, and Hennessy fires, all went on to become part of the LNU Complex fire.